My name is Ray. I'm currently pregnant. Uh, 32 weeks with my second child and have gestational diabetes. Hi! <laughs> you need to measure your blood glucose level four times a day. I set a timer, but it's very, very difficult to fit everything in. You can only have complex carbs. It is quite restrictive, it is very difficult. You can't have refined sugar. When you have any carbohydrates, you need to have some kind of protein. There's this growing consensus that it's your lifestyle, it's your fault. I was worried about the baby. I was also worried about if I would be diabetic in the future. I have been, you know, encouraged by the diabetes team to like, you know, stay active. I make time to do it for myself, for my kind of mental sanity at this like really difficult time. When you have gestational diabetes, you're offered a scan um, every four weeks from 28 weeks onwards. Um, this is my 32 weeks scan. Hello, I just finished the scan. The baby's doing fine, but um, her abdominal circumference has um, kind of shot up, which means that I'm not controlling blood sugar really well. Um, and it's really disappointing. There are days I feel like I should be careful and not like eat so much carbs, but like I'm in the middle of something and I'm feeding Joshua or, you know, I need to grab something really quick. It's been really hard for me. Um, yeah. This is what I do to relax. I knit a lot of hats for Joshua. Having the right support and understanding from family and friends is really important. Can say hi? Hi! <laughs> My blood sugar went back to like normal level like immediately after I gave birth. I'm really thankful about the care I received. They said breastfeeding really reduces the risk of me developing diabetes and my baby developing type 2 diabetes in the future. Last night as well, I was breastfeeding Emily and, and just feeding Joshua. And sometimes my husband would just feed me <laughs> because I was like ravenously hungry. So that's like family meal for all. The other advice they gave was to like maintain healthy lifestyle, healthy diet, so lots of complex carbs and instead of like uh, white carbs as a way of prevent uh, type 2 diabetes because I have an increased risk of developing uh, type 2 diabetes I should get annual um, check. If someone has gestational diabetes know that it's entirely not your fault. Do what's right for you and your baby.